welcome to the Sanity Workout. This is a new and streamlined program that even the most sedentary person can accomplish. As always, please make sure to consult your physician or health provider before you start any workout program. Yep. All right, time's wasting. You ready to get started? I'm ready if you are. Let's do it. This exercise is box sits. You're going to really be working your quads on this one and a bit of the core. So you want your those feet planted on the ground, your chest open tall and your core nice and tight. If you feel any stress on that low back, put those hands right behind you and rest back for your modification. Here we have our wall leans. You are standing up completely straight, shoulders leaned up against the wall and those feet just a few inches away from that wall. That core stays engaged as always. You're really working those obliques here. If you wanna make it just a little bit harder, go ahead and walk those feet out just a few inches and you're taking those arms, crossing them right over chest. Make sure to always work both sides of those obliques. You don't wanna overwork one side than the other. Here we have our brush offs. This is an awesome forearm workout. Make sure you are brushing in a nice smooth motion, not in a herky jerky way. Next, we have our pretzel rods. These are great because they really engage your core. So make sure you're relaxing those shoulders. That core is nice and tight and your chin is tucked and you're breathing through it. How does that feel? Really hard. Oh, good. <laughs> And next, we have our floor hold downs. Very similar to the pretzel rod. You're still laying flat. This time, your arms are out to the side. You're really putting pressure into that ground. It's going to activate that chest just a little bit more. This is really hard. Next, as you can see, we have our hammock curls. For this one, you're going to have your heels and your hands resting in the cradles, and you're just going to engage your abdominals. You can also engage your obliques on this one. Here we have our vertical extension chin up hold. You're going to have a nice tight grip on that rope. Shoulders are relaxed down and back. Make sure that chin stays in nice and up that whole time. Hips are tucked underneath and that core stays engaged. Make sure to continue to breathe through it. Our next exercise is 180s. For this exercise, we really focus on dexterity and getting your heart rate up for cardio. Make sure that you do it 11 times to the right and then 11 times to the left. How does that feel? Rough. Oh, good. Here we're working on balance with our battle wraps, turning nice, slow, in control as you wrap that battle rope around you, really focusing on that balance here. And for our cool down and our stretch, we have shoulder smirks. With this one, you're gonna bring your ear towards your shoulder. Make sure you hit both sides the equal amount of times, but you can go right, right, left, left, or right, left, your decision. All right, that's it, what did you think? It's actually a lot easier than it looks. Right? And it's a great way to kick off your day. Not every day though, you wanna make sure you take at least one recovery day. And hydrate. All right guys, good luck, have fun.